how to transfer your funds from OpenSea to Binance. Hello guys, welcome into this new video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how we can transfer our funds from OpenSea into our account from Bitcoin of Binance. So the way that we want to do that is by using a crypto wallet. In this case, I'm going to use MetaMask, which is the one that is too popular for using this kind of stuff. So the first thing you want to do is to go and log into your Binance account and to have another tab open about your OpenSea so you can see your profile again open. So now that you have your withdrawals of the OpenSea available on your account, that means that automatically you can see that in your wallet. So in this case, I was using MetaMask and if I go into my extensions, I might see that the Matic, the Polygon is now on my account. But if you cannot see the asset, you have to import that manually. So you can go, you can either go to Polygon Scan or you can go to the Coin Market Cap to add manually the token. Like for example, I was trying to add the wrapper, the wrapped Ether into MetaMask, which is in here. But it says wrapped Ether. So I went into Import Tokens and I copied this contract and I pasted it right in here. And it was actually pretty easy to add it in here and automatically i would see my funds into metamask so now what we want to do is to select the token that we want to send into our binance account in this case that would be medic sometimes there are a few that just won't work into binance so if that's the case for you you have to convert your token into another one maybe you can select into swap from you can select the medic you can put the amount and you can swap it for maybe ether or you can use usdt i don't know and after you've done that you select here the token that you want to be sent it and now that we are in here we want to focus in here where it says deposit so in this case we select the matic polygon which is in here and we have to select the network that we're going to be using in this case it's going to be matic polygon so now that i select matic polygon we have to copy the address that we're going to be sending into our token so i'm going to copy this address i'm going to go back into my metamask wallet now remember that i'm using the matic network and i'm using it right in here if you are not using polygon you might be using ethereum mainnet or whatever your tokens are so be aware of that so otherwise you're going to lose your tokens guys so now what you want to select is one that says uh the polygon in this case i'm going to select the matic and i'm going to go into send I'm going to paste the address that we just copied from Binance and it says the amount of that. I'm going to put the maximum amount. I'm going to go into next. So if I'm aware of that, I might be confirming it. If I don't, then I don't do it. But let's say I'm aware of that and I'm okay with it. So this is the queue of my transaction. I have to wait just a couple of seconds. You can spit this up if you want to. If not, you just have to wait just a little bit. Now let's go back into our Binance account to see if this one uh, actually worked. So I'm going to go into my wallet. I'm going to go into overview. And as you can see, I have a deposit that is confirming of .304962. Just as this one said on MetaMask. So we just need to have to wait just a couple of seconds. So this confirmation appears in our wallet. So yeah, there you have it guys. It was really, really simple. Just be aware and be really careful with the networks that you are using. If you are not using the same network, you might lose your money. So be aware of that guys. So that was it for today's video. Hopefully it was a very useful video for you guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more about this kind of stuff. Thank you for watching the video and I'll be seeing you guys on the next one.